in this tutorial i am going to show you how to protect and unprotect all the sheets in a workbook by using vba programming or vba code here we can see that i have three sheets sheet 1 sheet 2 and sheet 3 so if i want to protect all the sheets by using just vba code we can do that easily on sheet 1 i have two command buttons so first command button if i click it will protect all the sheets in this excel file or excel workbook and when i click second command button then it will unprotect all the sheets in this excel file or excel workbook so let's click first button and this command button has some vba code that is being executed when we press it so all sheets are protected let me press ok and let's try to write anything or change anything on this sheet so we get the message that cell or chart you are trying to change is on a protected sheet that means sheets are protected now let's go to sheet 2 or sheet 3 so on these sheets also i cannot write or i cannot change anything let me move to sheet 1 so when i press command button 2 so this second command button is unprotecting all the sheets now let's check if i can write anything yes i can write anything or i can make changes on any sheet so let me move on to sheet 2 here also i can make changes or i can write anything so these two command buttons have some vva code that i have written first command button is written for protecting all sheets and on second command button we have vva code that is unprotecting all sheets so let's learn how we can develop this or let's see what is the vva code which is responsible for protecting and responsible for unprotecting all the sheets so let me open a new excel file or new excel workbook I'll press Ctrl N and I'm getting a new Excel workbook. Here we have just sheet 1, so I'll press this plus sign to add two more sheets. On sheet 1, I'll go to Developer tab and here we can see that we have option. To insert any control so from active x control i'll use this command button so i will drag a command button then i'll copy this and paste it to get the second command button or we can go to insert and use this active x control for command button let me close my previous file so i'll right click on command button 1 select properties change the caption click to protect sheets and for command button 2 right click properties and then here I will write click to unprotect sheets
now i'll double click on first command button and let's see what is the vva code to protect all the sheets so i write dim ws as worksheet when i press enter it will do the formatting automatically and then dim password as a string and now i'll declare or assign a password value password equal to here we can give any password i'll give uh, abc we can give any password that we want now few more lines for each ws this variable we have defined for worksheet in worksheets and then for will end with next keyword in between for and next i write ws dot protect space password then colon equal to password once all the sheets are protected then after next keyword or in the next line i can give a user friendly message msg box all sheets are protected press enter formatting will be done automatically by vba itself so this vba code will protect all the sheets in this excel workbook let me minimize this vba editor window and we have second command button when i double click then here i can write vba code to unprotect all the sheets so to protect and unprotect all the sheet there is very small change that we can make in the already written vba code so what i'll do i'll copy and paste the same code however the change that i will do here we have ws dot protect so here i'll write worksheet that means ws dot unprotect and password equal to password so here we will give the same password that we have assigned while protecting all the sheets and then message i can change that all sheets are unprotected so these are some minor changes that we will do and now first button will protect all the sheets and second command button will unprotect all the so let me minimize this vb editor and now i'll click on design mode to come out of design mode and test the coding now when i click on the first command button i hope this has protected all the sheets when i press okay so let me try to write something in any cell i cannot write anything that means sheets are protected now when i click on second command button 
we are getting the message all sheets are unprotected so i expect that sheets are unprotected and i can write anything on any sheet so let me try to write something yes i can write so that means the code that we have written for protecting and unprotecting all sheets is working perfectly thanks for watching this tutorial if you like it please subscribe to my channel for more excel and vba learning tutorial thanks